Okay, um, for my peer review, I decided to do Chloe Wellman, and overall, I think she had pretty great composition, and um, I think all her photos looked, like, I think she had a good eye for them. Um, starting off with some basic principles and elements of photography and design, I think line really was captured in her photos. Especially through this one, it's all just very horizontal and it really grabs your eye, especially with the light and how the curtains kind of connect to the lines as well. I think it looked really cool. Um, another one that was really interesting for line was the piano keys. Um, it gave it kind of a depth perception too, the way she took the angle of it and it made it look a lot like um, longer than it really probably is. Um, this one had good line, and uh, line being the most important element in photography, I think she really like did a good job of capturing it through a lot of her photos. Um, this one has horizontal lines, has vertical. I think it was very interesting, this building that she decided to take a picture of. Um, overall, I think she captured line pretty well. Um, form, um, going back to the pianos, I know she had, did good line with the piano, but like I said, the depth perception in the piano was really interesting how she did that. Um, she also had good form with one other one. Who was this one? She kind of went upwards with the angle and made the ceilings look really tall with the angle she took. Um, let's see, texture. I think the pictures honestly have some texture in them just because a lot of them are the buildings around campus. Like this one, you can really see the texture in the stone in the UK emblem. And I think the angle she took on it really um, showed that, especially through the lighting that, that it was at the time. Um, these pictures as well have good texture. And um, I think the flowers are very colorful as well um, so she captured kind of the texture and color throughout them it's long along with the cactus too and um, the cactus and the pig I'm assuming this is had great texture and color um, so it looks really well well done there um, so the pro the proportion of some photos gave the subjects being focused on um, look more of like an importance so especially this one Everything kind of in the background is a little blurred, and I think she really wanted to take significance on this home um, area, like this little object. So I think that was really cool. Um, this one had a lot of busyness going on, but I think the lighting was what she wanted to capture most in this. Like, even though there's a lot of line and texture going on. I think the lighting looks really interesting. I think that's really what you look at the most throughout it. So I think she did a really great job there um, on this photo in particular. I thought it was one of the best ones. Um, color and texture along with these, the artifacts, I thought they were really cool. She got some different angles of them. Um, just has a lot of character to them and I think she really was going for that. Um, some weak photos I think that she might have had would have been this one. I think there's just a lot of glare on it from the lighting in the building. And I'm not really sure what it was supposed to, what her like thought process was here. But all I'm seeing are just three picture frames. And I think she could have done a little bit more with that. But I think she had a good idea in mind. It just isn't really, um, coming out. Um, other than that, I think that she could just improve on maybe more color and less neutral tones. I think she could have gone maybe outside of UK's campus as well. It seems to be that she just is at her dorm and walking around campus, different buildings around campus. Um, oh, this was also another one that I thought was really cool, though. Um, I just think she got at a really low angle um, and got the light to come right through the bicycles, which I think really grabs your attention and thought that was really interesting how she did that. Um, but going back to the weak spots, honestly, I think she could have just done more with her surroundings and maybe gone outside the box of UK and just kind of grabbed some other interesting um, photos because Lexington has a lot of different unique places that you can grab photos from.
can take pictures of, but overall, I think she had great composition. I think she hit a lot of the elements and principles of photography really well, and um, I think all her pictures were pretty great. Yeah, she did have great composition, so I think she did well.